My name is Dr. Heather Hampton. I teach at Heffron Elementary School. I've been here for two years and I've taught for Chicago Public Schools for a total of 11 years. We divide our bottle into Muchi Kalala is a kid-friendly science TV show and we were on the episode for tornadoes and what you see are two students that are trying to find the truth about different science topics. Gotta get to the bottom of this, but how? We gonna go chase tornadoes. Muchi Kalala was a good activity because I learned a lot of stuff. They created tornadoes. So cool. But no hoagies or grabinators in that experiment. Or skunks. <laughs> It was an exciting experience, and I want to say so because not only were we able to have a full production crew in Heffron, the students were able to participate in many hands-on activities, and then we were able to walk down the red carpet and see our premiere of our episode and sit in front row seats. It was an amazing experience. Thanks for testing our discoveries. And thanks for being part of the Muchi Kalala Detectives Club. A rigorous science program is absolutely important, and it's important because Students need to understand how to have collaborative conversations with each other. They have to understand how to use evidence as a basis for their arguments. They need to know how to use their reasoning within the world. I think science is important because it's like we do it all day, every day, so it's like it's like an important role in our lives. I allow them to take or to have the full autonomy to create and to develop on their own. My students research and then they develop a plan within their groups. They create their own types of experiments and then they facilitate that learning by actually conducting those experiments. Dr. Hampton is fabulous. She's what we call a super teacher. She makes sure that her children are interested in whatever it is she's teaching by making the lessons exciting, by having them be project-based, hands-on. She really involves them. She believes in small group instruction, so she knows for sure what her children know and what they need. We just have a lot of fun when I allow the students to determine their learning style and so that's my best part just their engagement in science. Grandpa had told the story about the grabinators. Hoagies and grabinators. Grabinators and hoagies made skunks.